And thanks for joining us. The results of a lab test have the community of Broadhead concerned. About two weeks ago, a vial was found on a busy sidewalk. Officers are now confirming that meth was inside that vial. Our Killy Arthur spoke to a man who says he helped get the vial to police. Talk to folks in Broadhead and you'll quickly pick up on the pride they have. It's a beautiful little town. Uh, a lot of history here. Great school system, great neighbors, and everybody works together in the community. Rich Vogel has called the small city of little more than 3,000 people home for 27 years. A great place to raise your family. In all that time, he says he's never encountered drugs. That is, until two weeks ago. It was probably about couple inches long, three inches long, something like that. On February 21st, Vogel says a friend found a vial later determined to contain half a gram of meth at the 2400 block of First Center Avenue. And I thought it was something that should go to the police department. Police say the most disturbing part of finding that vial of meth is that it was here, an area heavily trafficked by children and teens because of surrounding restaurants and a neighborhood in high school over that way. You don't want that in your kids. The discovery might be emblematic of a larger problem. On a Facebook post detailing the situation, Broadhead Police cited a 2016 study which found meth use between 2011 and 2015 jumped up nearly 300 percent, something residents of Broadhead want to change. Whatever the law enforcement can do, whatever um, our political leaders can do. In Broadhead, Keely Arthur, WISC News 3. Anyone with information about the vial should contact Broadhead Police or Greene County Crime Stoppers, and we have all of those numbers on our website, channel3000.com.